what's up everybody and welcome to your second 22nd JavaScript tutorial in this tutorial I'm going to be going over some very basic math objects and basic math functions that you guys are going to be using in your future programming now this is going to be a real quick tutorial because the rest of the tutorials from here on out are going to be pretty advanced so this is probably going to be one of your last basic tutorials and again in this tutorial we're going to be using another object and we're going to be working with the document write object to be using the math function with some built-in functions such as round and random so let's get started and uh, the first thing that we want to type is document and this tells JavaScript that we're going to be working on the web page itself JavaScript calls that the document and we're going to want to write something on it so just uh, put write we uh, use alert before but since we're going to be and we could put alert right here well actually uh, this will make it a lot easier just do this so never mind the last couple things I said but uh, as you can see in your object which this is a browser object because it's part of the browser you're going to want to add two empty parameters now inside those parameters since we're using a math function type in the word math now the next thing you type after this is going to be different all math functions begin with the word math and then you type the period and then you type what math function do you want to perform now these aren't functions you just make up JavaScript has built-in functions which you can find probably on JavaScript website or something but I'm just going to give you guys a couple of examples the first one called the round function rounds a number now if you're saying alright what number does it round exactly well that's what you have to give it now as you see we have parameters and we put math round in here now aside from these we're going to add two different parameters and put in any number we want let's put in uh, 3.14159 which is uh, the beginning of pi now as you can see if we save this and go and refresh it in our browser hold on run launch in firefox or one five has now rounded to three now what the JavaScript math round function does is round it to any whole number with 0.5 if you remember rounding up to four now if you're wondering alright but what if we have a negative number well let's see let's say we have negative 5.89 now if we save this and refresh this in our browser as you can see it still rounds to the nearest whole number now as you remember a whole number can be either negative or positive so make sure you remember that when using math round now another real basic one and one of my favorite functions that I use all the time is called math random and what this does is generate a random number for you now as you can see this parameter right here is going to be totally empty since why would you want to give it a number if it's just going to generate a random one so let's save this and refresh this and as you can see JavaScript gives you a random number now if you think this is uh, pretty worthless then uh, think again because anytime you're building like um, a game or something and you said you want something to happen half the time just uh this is something you do along with some other code that says alright uh, pick a random number 1 to 100 if it's below 50 do this if it's above 50 do this and that's how people get things to happen half the time randomly like if you're making an online slot machine or something so again the math uh, round function and the math random function are two very basic built-in math functions 
that use the math object. So study these and uh, just to get your basics if you want to learn more math functions they should be on a million different websites but I'm not going to go over them all. Just wanted to show you guys the basics of how JavaScript math works so I hope you enjoyed watching and as I said the next tutorials we're going to be getting into some more advanced JavaScript so uh, make sure you subscribe if you like my videos. Thanks.